Hi guys. So today I want to share another story with you. This one is, is different. Okay. So you guys know that I created another segment of my channel called Life After Housewives and they really took off pretty good. I decided to do it again. This time I'm going to do YouTube beef because you guys know I love to bring you stories of what goes on behind the scenes. That's what my channel is all about. We get behind what's going on with those crazy housewives and 90 Day Fiance. And now I'm going to let you guys know what goes on behind the scenes in YouTube, in the world of YouTube, which you guys would be totally shocked of what goes on. So I decided to do this series. And my first guest is going to be Steve McRae. Say hi, Steve. Hi. And sh his partner, Shy Shez. I hope I said it right. <laughs> Chess. You're good. Chess. Chess. We, Chess. I just did an interview with them and oh my God. Okay, you guys, this turned into something I never expected. It's huge, wouldn't you say, Steve? Like I'm overwhelmed. Uh, I, and, I, and I, again, I feel so bad that we're just kind of unloading all this onto you because it's years in the making. It is overwhelming for us and we've lived it for years. So I can't imagine somebody coming in and trying to absorb all this all at once. It's, yeah, it's inundating. It's blown yeah. my mind. It has really morphed into something I never expected, but it's a huge, bigger story here. So what I decided is to go ahead and bring on a couple more guests. This story, you guys, my audience is going to blow your mind. And at the root of the story would be Katie Joy. So I've decided to bring on a couple more guests. And then in the art of fairness, I want to extend an invitation to Katie also, because no one wants to be falsely accused, but this has morphed into more people than I expected. And these allegations are quite um, shocking. Would you describe it that way, Steve? Um, yeah, absolutely. I mean, I, I, when you have allegations, uh, we have a little motto. Uh, Chester and I do a show called Caffeine Corner. We're going to be starting again our old show, the non sequitur show eventually, which is in litigation right now. But uh, we have a motto. You don't respond to allegations. You respond to evidence. Ooh. And uh, she had many false allegations that had no evidence whatsoever. Mm -hmm. And so we have actual evidence of the fact that these allegations were without merit. And I've seen so some of your evidence ongoing. tonight. Yes, you absolutely have evidence. It's a database. It literally is a database um, that's been collected by multiple be. different people. It had to be because um, the person that we're talking about kind of goes around and tries to say the same thing about other people in different communities to try and spread it a little harder. I mean, there's some crazy things going on here. And I had did a little research last night too. And you're not the only one with basically the same cries as that Shocker. <laughs> I've been falsely accused of this. Yeah. It doesn't no surprise one, me. <laughs> yeah. It's all. insane. I, I, you know, this is unfair. And so we need to get to the bottom of the story. So what I want to do is bring on more guests, extend a vi invite to Katie Joy. Katie, you need to come on and hear what these people are accusing you of. And you need to defend yourself if you are innocent, because I wouldn't want anyone to put, Say these things about me and it, if it's totally false like you have to respond to these people and it's it's kind of a lot of people so we need to get to the bottom of this so i know steve that your people were waiting for something to come out tonight i don't want to disappoint them but i want to bring in a better it needs to be fair uh, it, it needs to be fair it needs to be have all the facts brought to the table. That's why I need to bring Absolutely. in more people. There's more people involved in the story. You're not the much, only one. Much yeah. more people. And so I want it to be accurate and I want everyone to have a chance to speak their side of the story, tell their truth, and let's get to the bottom of this because we can't have people going around the internet falsely accusing anyone of anything doing unethical things to other people's channels. This is crazy. So um, I don't want to disappoint your fans. I'm sorry if I'm disappointing you, but I think- Not at all. No, I, I, understand. I, I, I applaud you for this. I think it's yes. commendable. Uh, I wish there were uh, more YouTubers like that that want to do their due diligence because I, from, from experience, there are many out there, they don't care about the facts. They don't care about the verticality of information. All they put it out there and say, you know what? Could be true, could be not, but you know what? Gets views. And, it's, uh, so and people suffer because of it. it. And people have yeah. suffered in real life because of it, absolutely. And we have to put a stop to that. We need to bring in evidence, 
facts and get the story straight. And this is a doozy, you guys. I never expected this. I'm like really overwhelmed. And so um, we got to get the story out there. So I want to go ahead and personally apologize to your fans for not coming out tonight, but we will get to the bottom of it. And then we're going to do it in a forum. Steve, did you still want to take questions from the fans? Sure, I think it's absolutely, important. yes. We, we, we want the questions. Uh, we have absolutely nothing to hide. We, we've been documenting the stuff for quite some time. We've lived through um, mm. the stuff that Katie has done. Uh, we're not the only ones. And this is what I'm saying. There are other people as well. And I'm happy to have them come on and share their stories as well. Yeah. And sometimes so, having questions is better because then you, it brings up things that you wouldn't have thought to bring up otherwise and, and adds clarification for a mm -hmm. lot of things that sometimes just either sound like they don't make sense or th so, sometimes th stories like this that are this large can get very confusing. Right. Right. And we don't want it confusing. We want it simple with, verifications and everyone gets to tell their side of the story and so um we're gonna we need katie to come on too we need katie to come on and say what exactly is going on so i'm gonna push this back i do apologize to your fans and to my subscribers oh my god you guys i think this series is going to be just as popular as my behind the scenes of the housewives was i mean this is crazy but these are things that are true and happen and that YouTubers deal with. It's crazy. It's real, it's real life drama. I mean, it, it, this is our real lives. We, we are being affected uh, in real time by real people. Um, I, I'm not some celebrity out there, you know, looking for notoriety or anything like that. These are things that have happened to me and to happen to Cheshire. And it's reality like, internet. Reality Instead internet, that's actually reality true. Reality internet, yeah. that's what it is. Reality <laughs> internet. Also, I just want to go on the record and say, I enjoy talking to you guys tonight. Um, thank you. It. We've Likewise. been, oh my God. Oh, so, but let's do it again. We'll pick a date next week and with the other guests and hopefully Katie will join us too. And then we'll get to the bottom of it. Sounds so, amazing. Thank you. Sounds fantastic. Thank you. Okay. okay, you guys. Thank you.